First up, I love to use the Laura Mercier Hydrating Primer because my skin is a little bit itchy and dry and a little crazy from summertime. And it's just really easy and gentle on the skin. It doesn't cause breakouts, so I really, really like it. Then I'm gonna take the Urban Decay Naked Skin. It looks so good in person. It keeps your skin nice and glowy and dewy with looking like real skin and it's not cakey, but then it also covers a lot. Then I'm gonna pair it with the same concealer. And again, I like it. It's just nice and creamy foundation, but it has a really great coverage and it's nice and buildable. So a little bit could go a long way, but if you want extra full coverage, you could just add more. Then I always kind of buff it out with a sponge. That way there's like no lines and it doesn't get crepey and creasy. I picked a lot of products that I thought were good for all ages. And I just feel like if I were a real makeup artist and I was gonna do somebody else's skin, that was different than mine, I would use these products. I'm gonna take the Derma Blend Pro setting powder and I'm just gonna lightly put it in spots where I get greasy and I really wanna set everything. And the reason I'm using it with a little brush where I get extra greasy is just so more product lays down. And then I'm just gonna take a looser brush that's bigger and just kind of swipe a little bit all over my face just to set all of that creamy product in place so it you know stays longer. Then I'm taking this bronzer by Buxom. It's so beautiful i love the color of it it just looks nice and fresh without looking too orange or too shimmery or too shiny then i'm taking mykonos blush by buxom as well and i'm popping it on my cheeks it's more coral colored so i feel like it looks really pretty and natural like the sun hit you like you've been outside without looking again just too sparkly or over the top then i'm taking winky luxe latte kitten palette i love this it's so pretty for every day but then it also has sparkles in there and i'm just taking the sand color and i'm putting it all over my lid then i'm going to take the shade i believe it's called nutmeg and this is a little bit more of a gray color and i'm just going to focus it onto my lid and then as there's less product on my brush that's when i'm going to start buffing it out and i like to sweep it into just a little bit of a cat eye just to elongate my eyes because my eyes are really tiny and then i'm going to take the winky luxe liner i love this liner it's nice and black and I'm just going to do a cat eye. It's like my go-to. It's easy. Then I'm taking the Better Than Sex by Too Faced Mascara. I love this mascara. I always recommend it to people who are looking for a good mascara and it's like their first time buying a higher end product. Then I'm taking Hush Hush Lip Liner by Buxom and then White Russian and this is a matte lipstick and I'm just going to buff it in with my finger because I like it to look blended and not too harsh of a lip liner um, with the matte. So this is it. It's super easy. I hope Hope you guys like it and I'll see you soon. Bye.